Hello, I'm Todd Zakrzyk, Director of the Faculty Center for Innovative Teaching at Central Michigan University. This quick clip is a little bit about my life and some background for my professional interests. I've been married since the mid-1980s and have three phenomenal children. This is the newest addition to our family, Matthew Logan, who is my daughter's child, making me a grandfather for the first time just a few weeks ago. One of the things we've done as a family is to raise leader dogs for the blind. We're very happy and proud to be doing that. This is our fourth dog, Jake. Previous dogs were Libby, Glory, and Sam. And Sam is our greatest success, now living on the shores of South America and having a fabulous time down there. My educational career started in Cadillac, Michigan. And I lived in Cadillac pretty much my whole life. Cadillac is in the middle of Michigan on the shores of Lake Cadillac. It's a great little town of about 20,000 people. My undergraduate education was at Lake Superior State University in Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. I started out with a criminal justice uh, degree and ended up writing the program that's still in effect up there for criminalistics. But then I switched to psychology. I love psychology and finished with a bachelor's degree in psychology with a minor in sociology. I did all of my graduate work at Ohio University in Athens, Ohio. My master's and my PhD are both in industrial organizational psychology, which has served me very well for faculty development issues. Another wonderful thing about Ohio University is that they had a, a great way of training individuals to teaching classes. You started out taking a teaching course, then you were a TA, then you team taught, and then you received a course of your own, receiving quite a bit of support all along. I credit a lot of my academic teaching right now to Ohio University. Once I completed my degree, I got my first tenure-track job at Southern Oregon University in Ashland, Oregon. It's a beautiful place to live. I was promoted to Associate Professor of Psychology, received tenure, but then one day my daughter asked me if she had a grandma. At that point, we decided it was time to move back to the Midwest after spending about six years out in Southern Oregon. Still a phenomenal place. In 2001, Central Michigan University started a faculty development center. They did a national search for the director, and I was lucky enough to get that position. So in that year, I moved from Ashland, Oregon to Mount Pleasant, Michigan to start the Faculty Development Center. It was the following year in which I started the five-minute workshops as an approach to get into the departments and talk to faculty about teaching and learning. This is the website for our Faculty Center for Innovative Teaching. I started Central Michigan University in 2001. 2003, we combined the Faculty Development Center with the Learning Technology Group. Now we have a great deal of support for teaching and learning from both the technological and faculty development side in working together. If you'd like to look at more of our website, do a quick search on any major search engine under FACET, F-A-C-I-T, space, and then put CMU. That will give you FACET at Central Michigan University, and our center will pop right up. One activity we engage in every year in which FACET really enjoys is the Lilly Conference on College and University Teaching. This is a conference that's not disciplinary based and is specifically focused on teaching and learning. It happens every year in the fall in Traverse City, Michigan. If you have the opportunity, I encourage you to check it out. There are other conferences also from this Lilly series, and you can find all of us at lillyconferences.com. All one word, lillyconferences.com. Over the past five years, I've had the opportunity to travel around the country a bit and do presentations that are based on the theories of psychology and teaching and learning. I've spoken in 30 different states, done several keynotes, and worked with thousands of different faculty members, primarily on topics such as how students learn, overcoming apathy in the classroom, classroom assessment techniques, and motivating students to learn. In both my work through the Faculty Center for Innovative Teaching and my workshops, my biggest interest is to help faculty create effective learning environments for students. And of course that means finding ways to connect with faculty and getting faculty to try new and innovative teaching strategies. One prompt that I've used over and over again is to ask faculty members, what is the most pressing issue you face right now with respect to student learning? Finding responses to these questions or these issues, let's call them, is what drives my professional life. 
To investigate more of the resources we've developed for faculty members, simply visit facet.cmich.edu. That's facet.cmich.edu. There are many resources and tutorials available there, and you can always give me a call at 989-774-2757. When the topic is faculty development and student learning, I'm always available to chat. Thank you.